it's a big dogma, big myth, is people have ideas about what comes in to nutrition and nutrition for being more lean, more muscular and healthier. They have all these kind of a constellation of ideas. Um, uh, economist and philosopher Thomas Sowell calls them notions. So if you have a hierarchy of understanding, you have theory at the top, which is like gravitation, evolution, things super, super confirmed. After that, you have a hypothesis, which is, you know, you have a real good idea formally phrased. And underneath that, you have a notion. And a notion is just things people say, and people are like, uh-huh. And no one even asks or answers about, is this really true? And so when you talk to people about nutrition, or they talk to you about why they're not in such great shape, another thing I get is when you're pretty jacked and lean and you sit next to someone on a plane, they treat you almost like a religious figure, like a priest or an imam. And they're like, apologize. They're like, oh, you look like you're in good shape. I just haven't been to the gym. And I'm like, I love you as a human being, really? no matter people, what, all the time. Really? All the time. They apologize for the state they're in. More or less. So all these ideas people have about nutrition can go on for hours about these myths. But people come in with these myths as notions, as things they believe that they're like,